Jerry. All I ever asked for was the truth. That's the only thing you ever offered. But it was the one thing I thought I had. Jerry, this is rather a public place. You prefer an elevator? They said they'd kill his grandchildren. Was that your idea? Did, did, after I gave you his name, after you passed it along, did you suggest... I don't think you actually realized what happened. What happened was he was crying. When, when he changed his mind, changed his vote, I waited around to find out why. When he told me, told me what had happened, he was crying, crying because he'd been afraid to fight you, crying because he knows he'll always be afraid to fight you, you and that dirty bunch of thugs you work for. Turner. Mr. M. I'll, uh, I'll take it at the bar. Could you give me the phone, please? Yes, Farrell. Listen. What have you told that assemblyman about the setup? Uh, nothing. Uh, nor has he asked me why. Well, we're suddenly getting all kinds of calls and pressures from New England, Washington, the IRS, the FBI. They're taking a big interest in who worked for who, who you work with, and what ties there might still be between all of you. Based on what? Based on what? Based on communications between Lieutenant Kojak and those agencies in the last 24 hours. How can you know all that? Listen, if we can buy people in 50 states, we can buy people in the District of Columbia. You think there's a chance Murchison's playing both sides against the middle? No. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm sure. I mean, uh, why should he? Well, Buster, we're in the toilet. Now I have to go to my people in Vegas and tell them we'll fix the situation. Listen, when you come right down to it, that situation's a cop. A cop named Kojak. No. But think about it. If Murchison is working with them, say, on a secret grand jury probe or something, odds are they've been keeping it between themselves, you understand? Now, we eliminate Kojak, and you'll have enough on Murchison that he'll belong to us forever. Look, I won't go along with it. Who do you think the people in Vegas first suggest getting rid of, huh? Yeah, you think about that, too. Now, we'll work it right. Now, look, here's what you do. You call Kojak, see? You tell him you've done some thinking, and you want to talk to him privately. That's all I have to do, is to uh, set it up. Now, that's not all you have to do. You gotta be there when he shows. Be there when they kill him? If it bothers you that much, don't watch. Jerry. You better go after her. No, no. No, uh, something I have to do first. Later. I'll explain later. 